Hey guys, it's Sav. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a very easy and very delicious Asian-inspired calamari salad. Now, if you're like me, I usually order calamari as an appetizer. And if you want something different that's not fried, this is a good salad for you to try. It's using a lot of lime, lemongrass, um, mint, cilantro, garlic, a little bit of fish sauce, some salt. It is really good. Very easy to make. The only thing that's tedious is cleaning the square. It's a really easy recipe. And keep watching and I'll show you guys how to get this all going. Bye. You will need some lemongrass. And this is minced, about half a stalk. You will need two cloves of minced garlic, half of a red onion sliced, one small shallot, thinly sliced as well. And also, this is about half a tablespoon of galangal, finely minced. You don't want anyone to bite into some really thick slices or thick chunks of galangal because this is a really strong herb. And you will also need your herbs. So we, I have here a mixture of some cilantro and some mint. And you will also need some lime. Uh, food scissors here and I'm gonna tell you why you you're going to need this it's gonna make your life a whole lot easier using this what it'll look like and see the head here I'm gonna pull that head off and then you're gonna get some of the insides out here and I guess I'll show you how to clean the head first so I like to do this all in the sink and I prefer to do it um, on the side where it has a garbage disposal okay I have a bag here that I'm going to throw away all the yucky stuff that I don't need. This is why you need a pair of food scissors. See the eyeballs? I'm going to use my kitchen uh, shears and just cut across it like this. See? So now the eyeballs are gone. Nice and clean cut. And then if you flip it, you'll see here. That's the mouth, so we're going to remove that as well. So, see, so I just pulled it out, discard that, and then also you'll see two long pieces here. So this is what they use, a the squid use, uses to, you know, grab its food or its prey and it sucks it back into the mouth to eat. So we're going to remove these two as well. So just pull it out, see, and that's it. And now it's edible. So now I'm going to show you how to clean the body. So you'll see the two little parts right here, we're going to remove that. Once you remove these two parts, everything else is really easy to clean. So I'm just going to pull them off and then see some of that skin comes off. And then now the skin is going to be really easy to just pull off. And now the inside, I'm going to remove, see, we're going to remove this part, discard that. And then I just stick my finger in here and then just remove the stuff that's inside. See? You're done. And there is your cleaned calamari. So uh, my water is boiling right now. So now I'm just going to slice these just to butterfly it like this. And then I'm going to get a couple of slices to maybe four in each one. Okay. And then this is a small one, so I'm gonna cut it into three. I'm done slicing my calamari and I've cut them into little strips like this. But before we throw this, my water is already boiling. I'm literally going to cook this for like 15 seconds and then I'm going to drain and put the calamari into an ice water bath to prevent it from cooking any further. So I'm gonna go put some ice into here. So I have my ice here that I'm going to add in some cold water so that it's ready for me to um, drop in my cooked calamari. So now I'm going to dunk, throw this in. And now I'm going to, we're done. So now I'm going to turn this off and then drain this. So here is my cooked calamari that I'm putting in the ice water. This is I'm not giving you any exact measurements because it's a salad you can taste as you go along so I'm going to add here this is half of a red onion I'm not going to use all of it because it looks like it might be too much and then um, this is one whole 
shallot. Let's use half of that today. And I am going to use half a stalk of minced lemongrass and half a tablespoon of finely minced galangal as well. And um, two finely chopped garlic. So now I'm just adding in some freshly squeezed lime, about two to three limes. So now I'm going to add in my chili, sliced chili and chili flakes. Now I added in a little bit of MSG and I added in a little bit of salt. I didn't measure it and just a little bit of fish sauce and you're good to go. So now I'm just going to mix this yeah, all together. Very helpful. It's very helpful if you have food safe gloves. Now make sure you read the box because not all gloves are, you know, meant for handling food. You know, I didn't check the label on the one that I got, so I wish I knew how to read Korean. Oh, okay. well, judging by the photo on the packaging, it looks like I can use it. I mean, there's like picture of like fruit and vegetables on the packaging and it looks like it's safe to use with food. So I'm going to go with, I'm 99% sure that these gloves are food safe. Going to be so good. Very fast, very easy, very simple to make. I'm going to do a taste check here to make sure everything is good. Mm. So good. I tasted it and I think it needs a little bit more fish sauce. So I'm going to put more fish sauce. Just a little bit. So now I'm all done, I'm just going to plate my calamari salad. I've added some freshly sliced cucumbers and I've plated it also on some Boston lettuce. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you subscribe. Bye!